Well, it's still Sunday night, but we're very quickly approaching Monday morning in the work week coming along with that. Let's see how the weather is going to hold up for the work week. Let's get it right over to meteorologist Connor Thompson. Yeah, expect a quiet start to the work week. It's going to continue that trend of weather we've seen the last couple of days. Bright sunny skies and above average temperatures. Satellite radar is showing really not much happening. A clear night across the region. Patchy fog will once again develop as we head towards daybreak, but really no weather concerns over the next 24 to 48 hours. And you'll notice the wider view. High pressure remains, but you'll notice just down to the south of us, off the Carolina coastline. That's the system we're keeping a close tab of tabs on here as it moves up. We're making sure the potential for rain is in the forecast and we'll get into that in just a second here. Another nice night is ahead across the region. We are looking at sunshine to begin the work week like I mentioned and uh, yeah there's an isolated chances of some rain Wednesday into Thursday but really minor rainfall accumulations are expected and this is a major one as well more seasonable as we head towards next weekend instead of seeing upper 70s and more like low 70s. Uh, and again, you'll see that in the seven day forecast. But for tomorrow for the bus stop, yeah, 58 degrees, a nice start and heading on home from school around three o'clock. Yeah, look at that sunshine and uh, warmth. Temperatures in the upper 70s, some spots touching near 80. And with that also comes, like I've been talking about the last couple of days here, the potential for some low level smoke to move on through. But again, no impact on human health. It's gonna be hazy out there. So if you see some haze, that's why. And uh, you can see it's not really going to impact uh, m us much at all as we head to the overnight period. So future track remaining quiet across the area. No issues for tomorrow as we head into overnight uh, Monday into Tuesday. You'll start noticing a few more clouds work their way on into the region. That's thanks to that system to the south of us. No issues are expected from it, but a few more clouds. Still a dry day, a nice day overall for our Tuesday. Can't really ask for a better day, but uh, we're keeping a close tab eye on that as a system moves closer. So this is that system we're tracking. And, you know, I put a 30% chance in there. So very isolated in nature. And you'll notice really not a lot happening with this system. And maybe a few showers possible early Thursday morning. And then you'll notice an area of high pressure to the north of us will move on in and uh, clear us out as we head towards Friday morning. So while we do have rain in the forecast, it won't be an all day event. It won't even be uh, not, not everyone will see it be very hit and mess across the region. Tomorrow morning, low 50s waking up. Temperatures by the afternoon, mid to upper 70s. Overnight into Tuesday morning. Again, low 50s, mid 50s for most. And again, it's going to be a nice day. Once again, mid to upper 70s across the region for our Tuesday. Seven day forecast showing those rain showers on Wednesday. A bit cooler as well, but uh, overall, not that bad of a week, even with those rain showers in the forecast, really quiet conditions. 79 tomorrow, 78 on Tuesday, 70 on Wednesday, 73 on Thursday. Notice both Wednesday and Thursday have mostly cloudy skies. And then Friday, 77, the weekend looking nice. Partly mostly sunny skies, 74 on Saturday, 71 on Sunday.